capital of the United States, December 8, 1941. Today, the Congress of the United States convenes in a solemn joint session, a session that will hear the President of the United States deliver his message that will ask for a declaration of war with Japan. Gentlemen, we're standing by for further words from Honolulu, and we expect to rejoin them in just a moment. However, here's a bulletin which has just come into the NBC newsroom in New York. Nomura, the Japanese ambassador, and Kurusu, the special Japanese envoy, were at the State Department at the time of the White House's announcement of the attacks on Hawaii. The two Japanese went to see Secretary of State Hall at 1.35 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and remained about 20 minutes. Back in New York City, here's a bulletin. Honolulu, Japanese bombs killed at least five persons and injured many others, three seriously, in a surprise morning aerial attack today on Honolulu. The sky was filled with puffs of smoke from exploding shells fired by American Army and Navy anti-aircraft units. Whether surface vessels of the United States fleet were in action against the enemy could not be learned at once. Another bulletin, the Secretary of War has just announced that all military personnel on active duty is to appear Monday in uniform. <laughs>